slaves. You, to be a good slave, was they would give you some freedom. And when I say slave, I use that word particularly because a slave used to work his ass off and he would get food and a house in return. And 99% of people out here, my friend, are working their asses off. They can buy food and a house. That's it. Most people are still slaves. So most people who are slaves, they would tell you, you're going to be a slave, but you'll be free at least. You know, you can, you can do what you want. You can think what you want. You can say what you want. You can walk around outside, look at the trees. You're a slave, but you're free. Freedom, freedom, freedom. And what happened when they did this, something changed. The internet came. People start to talk. People start to think. People start to realize how money's made. People start to realize it's all a scam. People start to realize that countries are in massive debt because people are in massive debt and there's no way to escape. Cryptocurrency was invented. Now you have Bitcoin, which is surpassing the global reserve currency. We don't need banks anymore. We don't need the IMF anymore. People are starting to talk. People have elected Trump, a man who's not bought and controlled by the establishment. People are starting to actually get their minds right. So the people in charge are like, oh, fuck, we're losing control. We no longer control the money. We no longer control who's in charge of each country, oh fuck, we've got to put an end to this. We can no longer base our societies on freedom. We must base our societies on safety. You can't think for yourself. We can't put these videos on YouTube because it's fake news and it's dangerous. You can't go outside because of the virus and it's dangerous. You can't travel in between countries without that injection because it's dangerous. This is no longer about freedom, my friends. This is about your safety. They're going to take all your freedom away and instead they're going to give you a nice big helping of safety. And you're going to take it and go, oh, at least I'm safe. You were safer before. You were safer before. Because now the government can arrest you for saying something they don't like. Because now you're spreading fake news. You were safer when you could have an opinion. You were safer before all this shit. They're going to take all your freedom away and give you safety. And you're going to be less safe than you've ever been. And you're still going to be a slave.